going to teach you how to make a letter O. This is a really simple design. And what you guys will be needing is a hook, a loom, and a few rubber bands. So, you want your loom to be in this position, where all of these three are in the same row. To begin, you want to take double bands for this whole process until I say to use one band. So take two bands and go up. You could do this on the side if you want or in the middle, it doesn't really matter. And you want to go up until you reach the end of your loom with double bands. So it looks like this. This is all two bands going up, up, up until you reach the end of your loom. So now you want to do that on another row. I'll call these rolls, okay? And you want to go up again with double bands all the way until you reach this. So, it looks like this now, and we're almost done adding our band this fast. So it looks like this. These are all double bands. All the way till your end of your loom. So, now what we want to do is we want to twirl our loom around so the arrows are pointing down. Take one band of your color, or if you want to use another color, you can, but this is going to be attached to this, okay? So what you want to do is you want to take this single band, this is a single band, by the way, and you just want to twist it into an X like you do in handmade bracelets. Take the other side and put it on. That's a cap band. You want to add it on to one of these, you can use any, like that, on the end. So now you wanna go in that. I'm not really sure if you guys can see, because I'm using that. Grab the bottom two, pull it through the cap band, take it out, and pull it like that. You want to do that till you reach over here. So you should have something like this now on your loop. Maybe with different colors. I like. And now you want to take the one that you just loomed off your, on your hook and move it. Well, I'll stay because you just loomed it. So now go to the, uh, the bottom of the other line and add this part on. Like that. Oops, that was tricky. So now we don't need a cap band because we could act like this is our cap band. Go in at the bottom two, pull it through, and hook it up. We want to do that until you reach here. So it looks like this now. It's all attached now with this. See? Since we made this a cap band. So, now, as we have over here, we have this, the one for this one cap band. And you just want to start taking this part off. All oh, looks like it's one big line. Maybe after you reach a little bit, like, maybe right here, you gotta take the cap band, the end of this part, and you gotta put it on like that. Stick your hook in between all the bands. There are a few of them. Take one band of any color you want to use. I'm using the same color. And put it on your hook. Slip it through all the bands. And you might want to make it so that it goes in front of your creation. Take the one on like the second curve you could say and put it over the first one. So make a slip knot. Now you can take your whole creation off. I just wanna stretch a little bit. And there we go. Such a easy, simple charm. I hope you guys like this video. Comment down below, like, subscribe, and check out our other videos.